Uh, we've been kind of playing around with this guy. This guy is pretty awesome. Watch how fast he is underwater. I know you guys saw it a minute ago, but just when you hold the shift button, oh man, he's all about that life. What's going on guys, TBF Gaming, welcome back to the episode of Ark Survival Evolved, we're playing Ark Eternal on the Ragnarok map, check it out guys, we got some things going on today, as usual, uh, we got a couple things we want to get to right away, first of all, I just got a Capro saddle uh, made up, because we just knocked out a Capro, we're going to go do some underwater things, because uh, there's something I want to tame that we haven't tamed yet, one of the uh, Ark additions, one of the mods that we've got installed here, uh, first thing, let's see, oh, first thing we need some pants, I realize I still don't have pants on from like four or five days ago now, uh, let's see, oh, that saddles, armor, let's see, uh, there's a lot to choose from, let's see if we, I don't really care, we just want any one, riot helmet, that's pretty cool, riot chest piece, hold on, are there leggings in here, there we go, uh, fur, scuba, riot leggings, let's go with the riot leggings, let's see what those look like, bam, oh, and we need shoes, so boots, we're going to go with uh, just regular flat boots. doesn't really matter. We're going to say we're going to go underwater. And we're usually on our team anyway, so our, our armor doesn't really matter. As long as we got that one piece of, uh, what is this, the immortal uh, eternal gear on, we're pretty good to go. All right, so first thing, we're going to take Starscream if we can. Oh, is he up here? We're going to take Starscream out. There is a Stego out here that I really wanted to tame up. One of the robot Stegos. We wanted to go tame that guy up. Uh, and then, like I said, there's a water dino that we want to go tame. And we have to go get our Capro for that. All right, let's see. Still right here. Now, let me double check. This guy has 12 million Topor, 3 million hit points. So it's going to take quite a while. All right. Like I said, 12 million. Wow, that's so high. Luckily, Starscream does about 1 to 1 1.5 million, depending on... Uh, what kind of dino it is. There's 1.6. Oh, maybe even 2. Okay, 1.7 it looks like is where we're stopping. Alright, there we go. Uh, he only does 13,000 damage, so not too bad if he hits me. Alright, let's let him build up Topor a little bit. Get over 3. And we'll do this again. There we go. Should be well over 4 now. Where is he going? We don't want to sit here and just let him attack us. That's that's not good. I mean, he can't kill us or anything, but just not a good idea. All right, six million already. Just a few more hits. Won't take too long to knock this guy out. I mean, he just looks like he takes regular berries to knock out. That's weird. All right, there we go. Up over seven. I, I kind of wish I wouldn't have put so much speed into this bird. It makes it kind of hard to tame guys like this that are really slow and are not in the air. All right, there's eight, eight point three. There we go. Let's build that up over nine. All right, is he gonna turn around one more time? Nope, he's running. Okay, 10. That should be 11 point something, and then we'll bind him one more time and he'll be up to 12, and then he will knock out. And that's gonna take a while for him to wake up, so we'll pretty much knock him out, leave him here, and then come back later for him. There we go, 11.7, and there you go. Go to sleep, buddy. Should be out. There we go. Alright. I doubt I have berries. I don't think I have any berries. We need to get someone out here that can gather some up. Up, uh, yep. This thing again. I can't get through there. Who can gather berries decently? Um I don't really have like any anybody who's great at gathering. Actually, does our bear nah I don't wanna mess with him. Uh one of the big guys probably could. Maybe them. All right, let's take one of you guys out there, like so, and pick up. I think this guy gathers berries. We'll find out in just a second. Uh, we'll, we'll get some berries on this guy, and then we'll head out, head out for their cap room. We'll do some of the underwater stuff that we talked about doing. All right, okay, feel free to let me out. If you guys can't tell, there's fences right here. That's why, that's how I was able to build the glass up above there, and it seemed like a really good idea, but you can't do anything because everything's in the way now. I don't know, not the best idea. All right. Okay, do you gather berries? Yes, you do. Good job. Way to go, buddy. Good job. All right. Let's go over here. Take uh, these ones and these ones 
And those ones. There we go. We'll just put everything on here, and then we'll just leave this guy be. 540 is a pretty good level. All right. There you go. Take all the Mijos, those ones, and those ones. You can have them all. 0.4%. Holy cow. So 0.4. I mean, luckily his food is at zero or close to, so he's going to eat a lot. Uh, but it's just going to take a while. <laughs> so weird. All right. So you can go back in base. So let's go like that. Go ahead and jump back on here. And then I'm hoping I haven't teleported since then. We're just going to teleport uh, on foot out to where we got to go. So Star Screaming here. We try to always park our favorite teams inside it inside so that way if anything happens, uh, these guys don't all die. Because there has been a few attacks. The big guys I'm not so worried about. Uh, but a lot of the little guys you got to be careful with. All right. Do I have anybody? Make sure I don't have anybody on my shoulder. Oh, I do still. Let's go put him back. And then we will teleport. There we go. You hang out over there. Thank you. Alright. And then we'll go out here and teleport away from everything so I don't accidentally teleport someone with me. Alright. Last remote location. Hopefully the same place. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't mess this up. Alright. And where are we going? Hopefully in the desert right next to a Capra that's tamed, right? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh, he is certainly not tamed. And what is that? That's just regular raptor, but wow. Okay. Let's go, let's go Katana Sword this guy and try to figure out what's going on with this Capra. Oh, no. I forgot that they do that attack. Get up. Get up. Oh, I forgot this new raptor attack. Absolutely awful. Where'd they go? There you go. <laughs> Alright, I don't know what happened to our Capro. Alright, there's a Sarko. They don't... Do they have, like, incredibly quick Topor? He might. That might have happened. Oh, no. Okay, this might have been the same one, but I thought the one that I knocked out was a lot higher level. So I don't know. I'm not sure what's going on. So let's kind of watch the Topor on this guy. Does it go really fast? It must. So maybe we'll have to sit here and babysit it to make sure it doesn't wake up. I'm not sure. All right, so we'll throw a bunch of meat on there. Uh, it's fairly slow. And let's watch the Topor. Yeah, Topor's going down pretty fast, so that might be it. So maybe I need to go get some more uh, narcotic, and we'll see if we can keep this guy asleep. I mean, it, look, it's... It's eating fast. All right. Let's run back super quick. I'm going to get a whole bunch of narcotic and see if we can keep this guy asleep. Okay. We teleported back, but it kind of jumped us forward like we had jumped. That was really weird. All right. So he might make it. We're going to throw a couple of narcotic on him just in case. And I don't know if this narcotic will work. I didn't really think about it. Uh, we're just going to put it all over there. Let's just go like crazy with it. Okay, I'm going to make him eat like just a ridiculous amount of the narcotics, see if it keeps him asleep here. There you go. Make sure that unconscious doesn't start going down too much. Feel free to start eating again, buddy. Come on. So you 64% taming. So I'm going to kind of look around. I don't know if this is the same guy that we were messing with before. I hope it is. Uh, well, I mean, I hope it is. It doesn't really matter as long as we're taming one. But I was pretty sure we had a much higher level. All right, so I'm going to kind of wander around just a little bit. I'll keep checking on this guy, and hopefully we'll get him knocked out uh, so we can go underwater. What I need to do with this guy is we need to go get some biotoxin. That's what actually we're working on is just going to get a bunch of biotoxin. And then, uh, you know what? They need to make a rideable version of this guy. Uh, but we're going to get a bunch of biotoxin and then uh, go tame up this new fish that we have from the uh, dino mods. And I, I can't even think of the name of it right now. I'd pronounce it if I could. Oh, you know what? He's going to tame up right now. So let's do this. Let's go like that send you home like so bam okay and this guy will be tamed up in just a second watch him wake up now and kill me all right there we go all right cancel that let's get a saddle on this guy not a super impressive level but that's not really the important part here all right saddle yes and then we're gonna go ahead and throw some scuba gear on just so i don't have to worry about oh you know what i don't i really don't want to take that off Let's leave that on and go scuba tank. Hmm. 
Now we'll, we'll we'll probably go ahead and go with the scuba mask. So you guys can see a little better underwater. Let's go like that. Uh, let's see, scuba mask. Bam. Okay. Now we should be good. All right. A little bit of jump action. Hopefully this guy's got a little bit of speed. Oh yeah. Oh, we're gonna fly through the water. Perfect. All right. Let's go find some biotoxin. Just gonna go right out, right out here to where there's some things. We gotta be super careful because I showed you guys a few episodes ago. There's still a spawn issue. We did check it already. Uh, there's still a spawn issue with the Tussle Tooth is just spawning like absolute crazy. So we're looking for not the fish, but like the little uh, bottom dwelling things or some angler fish. So we got to go to the deep, deep water. Why are we? Oh, is our is our guy hurting a little bit? Hold on. We should heal him up. What were we think? What were we thinking here? No, that's not it. Oh, the topor is going up still. Hmm. Did all that stuff that he... Let's get that off of him. Okay, don't fall asleep underwater, please. That flashing is going to drive me crazy. All right. <laughs> Let's go down here. Oh, there's a big guy. Be careful of that. Big mosasaur. See these guys? Nope. Should find some down here somewhere. There's another big guy. Definitely avoid that. Here we go. No, no anglers. Oh, Tuslo. No, no thank you. Now, I do have black pearl on me. Oh, my God, an alpha Tuslo. <laughs> I do have some black pearls on me. Uh, so if a Tuslo does grab me, maybe I can feed it real quick and tame it. Uh, but with the rates kind of messed up for the taming, it may not work. <laughs> so it might not be a thing. All right. I'm definitely not seeing the kind of guys that we're looking for here. Oh, there's so many bad things out here. You gotta be super careful. All right, let me get over to the side of the map that I need to be on, and I'm kind of worried about this topor. How are we doing? Topor's still going up, uh, and this guy's not like super high topor or anything, so we gotta be a little bit careful. All right, guys, let me get back to base, uh, and then we'll go. That's kind of the area we need to go water-wise uh, to get ourselves filled up. All right, guys, we got some level ups going. We went ahead and threw a medium XP potion on there, so he's actually got some pretty good levels now. Let's take that off for a minute as we kind of cruise this way. Uh, I also want to see if this guy takes fall damage for as good as he jumps. He actually jumps pretty well. I want to see if he takes fall damage and hopefully doesn't die uh, on this jump here. If he dies, then that means we need to get another one. But uh, <laughs> uh, looks like very minimal fall damage. Very nice. Very cool. All right, let's go get in the water. Pretty much straight out here is where we want to go. Still got the scuba gear on, so hopefully you guys can see okay underwater. All right, there we go. Let's do it. Hopefully it's not too dark. All right. We're going to go straight out here. Like I said, we got to be super careful. There are a lot. Let's turn the spike glass back on. There are a lot of Tussle out here. We found them earlier as we were kind of going around on a frog, but we realized the frog does not attack underwater. Look at that. They're just everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. All right. Get over here, and then we should be able to drop down. Here we go. All right. Straight down this way. Oh, my God. Okay, this was not here before. We came through here before. This was definitely not a thing. Okay, we got to be just a little careful. There's their eels following us. Yeah, watch out for the eels. Oh my god, there's so many things down here. Yeah, this was not a thing a few minutes ago. We came down here and it was just really lightly populated. Okay. I want to test those guys, but I don't know what kind of damage we do. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Let's try it. Why are we not doing any damage? That's scary. Okay. We killed one. All that attacking, we killed one. Are we having some frames because of so many things down here? We might be. Okay. How about these guys? There we go, attack. <laughs> okay. They're not giving me what I need. Oh, what? No, 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 no. Watch out for those guys. Come on. Keep going. Get away from the eels, please. Although the eels are probably who I need to take out, aren't they? What is that? The tussle way up there. Okay. Oh, I don't want to do this, but let's let's eat a couple of the, these guys. Oh, here we go. Anglers. Oh, I can't. 
Why am I not getting him? Okay, I'm not doing any damage. I feel like we should get off and let him do his own thing. Alright, did we get any biotoxin? We didn't, but we didn't eat the bodies, did we? Hold on, come to me guys. Come to me. Eat him. Eat him. Just don't fall off the table. Okay, here we go. Something in here, right? Angler gel. Hmm. I didn't see any... I saw angler gel. Wait a minute. Let me, let me look up. How do I make biotoxin? Am I in the wrong place? I might be. It's been so long. I'm not even sure if we're doing the right thing anymore. Alright, let's go over here where it looks a little safer. Alright, anything attacking me just yet? No? How we doing, Topor? We're doing okay. Let's go all melee. Alright, give me a second to look this up and figure out what we got next. Alright, so I think we actually are on the right track. We need the, the jellyfish and not the not the eels or the uh, anglerfish. So let's go. I know I saw some jellyfish as we were swimming through here. Gotta be careful. I've seen a couple more tussles down this, this level also. There we go. Now, please don't knock me off my guy here. Alright, they're coming to us. Okay, oh, no, we got knocked off. Oh, crap. Oh, no, 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 no. And we don't we don't have fins on. Uh, this could be over. Oh, okay, okay, hold on. Can you follow me? Oh, come on, please follow. Please follow, there's so many bad things down here. I don't want to die. Oh, it's over. Oh, we are going to die for sure. Oh, this was a bad, bad mistake. We've made so many mistakes. Mistakes were made, guys. Oh, no. Okay, I can't even see. I can't see. Okay, we, we've got a nice pike, but I don't think we're going to be able to kill these guys. Oh, no. Save me, Capro. I'm not too worried about us, because we... Anything we lose, it's not a big deal. Okay, we did kill something. Okay. We're still alive. Holy cow. Okay. I don't know how much damage I'm actually doing. We're only doing 42 damage. Holy cow. Okay, how about this sword? Swing the better sword. Alright, we killed one. Okay. Kill him. Kill them all. How are we still alive? Holy cow. Okay, is he close to us? Get away. Get away, snakes. Eels, whatever you are. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Oh, I don't even know where our Capro is anymore. There he is. I see him. Oh, and it's finally over. We lasted a lot longer than usual. Must have had some good armor on. All right, we're able to rescue our buddy there. We got him out. Uh, did not work out. He did kill a couple of the... Uh, what do you call them? The jellyfish, but didn't get anything off of them. So I don't know if it's because we weren't riding it and he didn't get lucky enough. Okay, there they are. So it looks like they both tamed up. Good to go. So we're just going to take one of them. I just knocked both of them out because we had arrows. All right. I also have a tussle saddle. We're going to try to tame up real quick a tussle. Uh, if it's like everything else where all the rates are kind of messed up, uh, we don't have a chance to do it. But it, if the rates are good, then we could get it done. So what I want to do is this. Consume, and then we're gonna <laughs> level up his speed a little bit so I can get there faster. There we go, and his health, so he doesn't die right away. There we go. All right, let's go see if this works. It may or may not work. I really don't know. Look at that fast turtle. All right, but there, there's tussles all over the place. So we should be able to try to tame one up pretty quick. But if they don't tame really fast, I. Uh, we're not going to be able to do it today. There's just not, not a way we can do it. I wish I could go up there and get rid of that guy. We've been trying to take out any of the skeleton ones that we can see. Wow, you were a lot slower than I remember. I really should have brought my frog. Man. Okay. I don't know if I have the patience for this guy yet. Yeah, Alright, let me uh, let me wake, <laughs> make my way out here. Alright, here we go. We're going we're gonna to see if this works. I don't think I have any cooked meat on me, do we? No. Because uh, it says something about cooked meat actually works better. I'm not really sure. Alright, so let's see how this works. It's been a long time since we've done this. He should come grab me and I should be able to swim to his mouth and throw a black pearl in. Uh, he's behind the rock over here. Okay. Here we go. Any time now. 
Okay, are you not gonna... Um... Okay. Is there something buggy going on with the Teslas? What is going on here? I don't know. Really, really weird. Let's go up a little bit so we can attack this guy. Oh my god, this guy's gonna take forever. <laughs> Alright, we're about to lose our turtle because we got got by some, uh, uh, what do you, the, uh, jellyfish, the Sinandria, or whatever they're called in this, uh, game. Uh, yeah, turtle's doing pretty good, though. He's got really high health, so I'm not, not gonna die quickly. But we're trying to tame up. We did knock out a Megalodon real quick. We're gonna see if maybe he can help out. There you go. Eat, can you eat them, or are you gonna get stuck, too? You are gonna get stuck, too. Alright, I don't know what to do against these guys. There's not much that I can do. Oh, there you go. He killed one. Okay. You gonna get the rest of them? Maybe. Maybe not. He's gonna end up dying. If I can get close enough to heal without dying myself. Okay, hold on. No, we had it. We had it. Come on. I can heal him like this. If I can get close enough. There we go. Bam. Bam. There you go. Take him out. Take him out. You got him. Come on. Come on. Get another couple bites in. Wait, do I have any other arrows? What other arrows do I have? Uh, Just regular ones. What kind of damage do you guys do? Hold on. Let's see if we can help him out a little bit. Okay. Did I hit the right guy? I don't think so. Finally got him. There we go. Okay, hold on. Can I harvest off of him now? Hold on. I can't. Why can't I harvest him? And I don't have a saddle for the Megalodon. Hold on. If I get a saddle for the Megalodon, can I teleport out of water? I think I can. Hold on. Let's tell you to. Let's tell you to hang out. I don't want to teleport him on accident. That would be a bummer. All right. Let me teleport. If possible, to the house, get a megalodon saddle, and then we'll see if we can eat the Sanandria that way. Oh, hey! Also, just so you guys know, the robot stay goes up. Hooray! All right, let's uh, let's teleport back out there. Uh, I have a megalodon saddle on us now, which I could have actually made out there. We didn't realize we had all the supplies for it already. Uh, so let's try this again. I st I can't believe that these uh, Teslas just don't want to be tamed. I guess because of where they are. I'm not really sure. All right, there's our buddy here. Why are you way over here? Let's just make sure. You don't have anything on your inventory already, do you? No, just a bunch of meat. Alright. There we go. We're gonna go like that. We're gonna use a tiny XP potion on you. And then... We should get some stuff out of it. Consume that. There we go. You are really slow. Are you overweight or something? You you are a little overweight. Okay. Let's go all damage. A little bit of health. And then all damage. There we go. Alright. Let's get you healed up. Now, can we harvest this guy here? And we missed. Come on. There, finally. Biotoxin. Holy cow. Alright. 
I do want to kind of see what happens if I teleport if I'm on the shark. Let's see. Does it teleport the shark? I'm going to feel kind of bad because he'll die instantly on ground, right? No, okay, it won't because I'm on a water tame. Okay. How about if I'm on you? We'll take you home even though we don't need you. Home. Let's see. Maybe? Possibly? There we go. All right, guys. Give me a second to kind of uh, clear up my inventory, get a couple things done, and we'll wait till daytime. And we'll finally go out and tame. I think it's called like an Archeon or Archelon or something like that. I'll show you guys in just a few minutes. All right, guys. I'm not sure if I even showed you this. I, I did tame this in between episodes. It's a little glow tail. Check this guy out. A rideable glow tail. Pretty cool. Uh, doesn't really seem like it's worth using, uh, but it's really cool. Check it out. Look at that. So cool. Rideable glow tail. This guy is pretty awesome. Uh, he's kind of fast. Uh, he might take a lot of damage from this fall. I don't really know. Oh, yeah, he just took a lot of damage. Let's get some, uh, healing on this guy real quick. Uh, like so. Okay. Now, we are gonna die from this. Oh, man. Crap. Crap. Consume. Instantly. <laughs> just keep healing him. Okay. So this is a poison glow tail. I've tried to bite a couple things to see if it's, if it's really worthwhile. Uh, I wish it like floated or something. It feels like it should be able to float with those little wings, right? Uh, but it does not. Pretty fast in the water. That's why we brought it down here. So let me finally show you what we're looking for over here. This guy right here. The Archelon. Here we go. Hope you guys can see it right here. Giant turtle. Look at that guy. So let's get over here on the land. Park this guy here. Alright. You stay there. Alright. Let's get the biotoxin. Uh, which I probably left back on the Megalodon. Holy cow. I'll be right back, guys. Okay, back one more time here. All right, let's get the biotoxin. We grabbed half of it. Hopefully, it's going to be enough. All right. Hopefully, the Megalodon, everybody doesn't come visit me real quick. Let's see how many feeds this is going to take. 5%. So, that's going to take a lot. Uh, about 20, 20 feedings here. How long is it going to take in between feeding? Uh, it's going to take a minute. All right. All right, guys. Let's kind of hang out and wait. And uh, I'm going to feed this guy 20 times, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys. We're down to the last two feedings, so it should just take about exactly two minutes or so. We've been timing it out pretty much a minute and some change in between feedings. The first one, in between the first and second feeding, was like a good seven or eight minutes. So uh, it's taken about 30, I think about 30, 35 minutes so far just to get... Uh, him tamed this high, but we've been doing this for almost an hour because he got attacked by a couple megalodons and then your taming starts over. So that's a pretty long process. There's my little alarm going off in the background to tell me that uh, it's time to feed him again. I, got, I had it set for about a minute and some 10 seconds or so. So he should be, there we go. And look at that, one more, 99.4. Ah, come on, man. Need you to hurry up with this last minute. So final minute here. And then we'll be ready to feed him for the last time. As long as nothing happens, it's almost dark out, of course. We've been out here all day in game time. Uh, we've been kind of playing around with this guy. This guy is pretty awesome. Watch how fast he is underwater. I know you guys saw it a minute ago, but just when you hold the shift button, oh, man, he's all about that life. He is the ultimately fast water guy. Pretty awesome. Let's not get out of draw distance here. I don't want this guy to stop. Uh-oh. I'm lost. We got so excited about cruising around with this guy that we forget where we're at here. Uh oh. We're actually lost. Oh, yep, and there's my alarm telling me that it's time. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Okay, we're back. We're back. Hopefully he didn't like start over because I left draw distance. I will be so depressed. Alright. Let's see. Final feeding? Come on, come on. Yes, there we go. Our new best friend. Check it out. Level 898. Very, very cool. All right, let's have you hold still. Okay. And I'm pretty sure, I'm fairly sure he goes on land. Let's just make sure. Let's jump on our glow tail here. We'll go up on the land. Where is he? There he is. Uh, we could have used a pickup block, but we'll, we'll have him come over here. Make it easy for us. Okay. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, he is not fast. Okay, okay, okay. You're slow. Stop there. Super, super slow. Alright. Let's go like this. Activate. 
I'm going to take him back to base. We're going to get a saddle made up. And then in the morning, uh, we'll take him out and test him out. All right, guys, we're doing a little bit of testing with this guy. He does 225 hold damage, so he, he's not exactly an attack guy. He is super, super slow on the ground. I've got a couple levels to throw into him, but we want to get into the water first and see what else we can do. Uh, pretty interesting. It looks like he can have a few extra people on here. To get on here, it looks like, let's see. Passenger seat. There we go. Yeah, so you can definitely do that. I wish you could do third person view while you're sitting in a passenger seat, but that's okay. All right, let's get back on him. So it should take me about an hour to get to the water here. Holy cow, he is slow. Hold on, let's let's use the potion. Get a couple levels on this guy. Yeah, we'll see if we can upgrade the speed just a little bit. Here we go. Yeah, let's see, noticeable? There we go. <laughs> Not much better, but uh, so loud. This guy is super loud. All right, here we go. Hopefully he's not too slow in the water. Uh, okay, he's not fast. He's definitely not fast, but he's not like horrible slow either. There's just regular. There's speedy. So interesting. I did a lot of work to get this guy today. We spent uh, about three and a half hours because it took us so long to get biotoxin. Uh, we just had trouble getting biotoxin. I died several times. We used a Capro, we used a Megalodon, and finally got it with a Megalodon. Uh, not the best way to do it. We did try to tame a Tusk, though, but apparently Tusks are a little temperamental and didn't want to uh, eat the food. Uh, that's the thing, I guess. All right, guys. So I think that's all we got time for. We, we wanted to at least tame this guy up. He's pretty cool looking. I don't know how useful he is. Uh, I guess as a transport dino, if you had like a tribe, maybe it would be pretty cool. He's got one, two, three, four, and, and plus I'm on, I'm on a modded server, so it's a little bit different. But I think on a base server, maybe it wouldn't be so bad. Like, you know, one without Arc Eternal and stuff like that. It might not be such a bad thing. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty cool. I don't know. I don't know that uh, I'll play with him again, but I'll definitely have him at my base and, you know, show him off to people. I think it looks cool. All right, guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode of Arc Survival Evolved. Playing Arc Eternal on the Ragnarok map. Thanks, guys.